hello dear learners welcome to my google cloud video series today i will show you how to deploy laravel with database on google cloud app engine so let me show you my project on local environment first this is my local project and i am going to show you this application on my browser this is our application its login and logout. It's just a simple authentication application by Laravel. Okay. I just sense the session driver and cache driver from file to database and created migration tables for session and um, cache. My database information is tutorial and username is root let's browse our <coughs> local environment it's cache table migration table password reset table session and user table now we need to migrate our database to our remote sql server i created my sql instance and now i am going to connect my sql instance via using uh, sql proxy so I am opening another command from Fred. I'm going to my app drive CD CD DIR. I just download Cloud SQL Proxy dot exe from Google Cloud documentation, and now I need to connect SQL instance using this. So Z Cloud SQL instances describe describe our tutorial instance tutorial. Let me copy this my connection name and Cloud SQL proxy minus instances instances and instances name tcp3306 it will allow me to connect from our local environment to google cloud f engine okay google cloud sql instance Okay, ready for new connection. Listening port on this host and port. Okay, I am opening another command prompt to connect that host. Just my SQL minus ace 127.0.0.1 minus a root minus p. I am giving him root password at the red hash now I, have, I am connected to my cloud SQL server okay let me show you show databases Databases Our database is tutorial performance schema MySQL. Okay, I am going to tutorials Databases It will show performance schema, information schema, MySQL, MySQL, performance schema, performance schema, tutorial, and tutorial. Let me create another database. Create database to Laravel. 
let's just reload this tab loading databases So we just created this database from our command prompt. Okay. Now I need to create a user for this Laravel. Let me check our users. We already have two user root and tutorials. I'm creating another user using this command prompt. Create user. laravel at host any create user laravel at host any identify it by laravel okay another user is created let me just check so we created a user called Laravel. I'm giving the all permission. Grant all privileges to Laravel. Yes. On to Laravel at local host any one row zero row affected FLU is plush privileges so I'm um, that database creation part is done now I need to migrate our tables to Laravel database okay I'm going to my its project running let me just close it and I am now my tutorial folder I am modifying the configuration database 3306 tutorial it's our database is now laravel username laravel password laravel and my local XAMPP is currently stopped so I am migrating my database to cloud host in my tutorial project PSP artition migrate Migration table created success. Okay, let me check the tables. So use Laravel. Show tables. Okay, cache, migration, password reset, session, user. All table are created. User, password reset, cache, sessions, and migration is created to our MySQL instance. Okay. So, now the remaining thing is Google Cloud App Engine don't allow dot .env file. So, we need to create app.yaml file so this is our app.yaml file we see the connection name here connection name yes this is our connection name okay I'm copying and pasting it here tutorial 
tutorials tutorials here okay I am giving database information TV port DB host localhost database name tutorial username tutorial oh, so database name is Laravel username Laravel our password is also Laravel so I am giving the all information about database it's done now we need to just put a script in JSON file post deployment script you must put it here post post deployment CMD okay now I am just renaming this env file let's just rename it so app removing env file or you can delete it from here now we need to deploy it on our zcloud app deploy It's just telling that we already deploy it. I'm just closing this terminal and opening new terminal. ECD website, stdocs tutorial, zcloud app deploy. Okay, it's giving a short description source source our tutorial folder target project tutorial 1979811 default even version name I'm just proceeding by pressing Y just finishing this on deployment okay yes our deployment is done now we can browse our application by using this URL I am just copying it and going to my browser and paste it in address bar let's load yes these are local application and it's now it's my app engine application okay so thanks for watching this video I hope you will subscribe to my channel thanks for